people, welcome back. More Vine and Wine. So you already know what day it is, you already know what deck we are using. So hopefully I open up okay. Uh, like you still, you know, like I said, I promised this week I was going to go ahead and look at the deck before starting. You know, hopefully this deck is correct, because come on, this is this is the deck that I'm, I'm just going to say famous for, but I'm not famous, so. It's Supervised. This is the most popular deck on Vine and Wine. Come on. Oh, opened up with Tinker. Oh, this hand is great. This hand is perfect. You cannot ask for a better hand than this. You cannot. This is perfect. I opened up with the Tinker, which means that I don't have to send it because Doom Charming can summon it, of course, from my hand. And I got the Rota and the Foolish to go ahead and send the Ebel and the Doom Shaman. And I got two pieces of Revival. Beautiful hand. Beauty a full hand. No complaints. Thank you. Thank you, in the end. I have no complaints. My opponent over here has two cards in the extra deck. Like... So you can put two, but you're too lazy to put more? Like, just put more cards in the extra deck. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and set the Oasis, and end my turn. So if you want to go ahead and throw that MST at me, I will go ahead and chain the Oasis, summon Bill, summon the Tear, then I have Tear, and then next turn I'll go ahead and summon Doom and go for Beals. Classic play. SS Effect. Who's SS Effect? Oh, because you have no monster in your graveyard? Wow, and you're not going to attack me. I don't run Goyo Guardian. Maybe I should. Alright, if your opponent controls monster, if your opponent's monster attack, you can switch it to a direct attack and then I can't do any damage as long as he controls the monster. That's cute. I'm gonna kill that thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna scrap dragon it. Yep, scrap dragon. Scrap Dragon, target, target Armageddon Knight, because I don't need him anymore. I need everything else, so, target Armageddon Knight, kill the, then, you won't control a monster, and, uh, actually, you know what, I'm going to kill you. Do you have any, I'm going to kill you. So, I need to get rid of you. Yeah. If your opponent, if your opponent's monster, you can make a direct attack instead, so I destroy this. Which means I can attack the monster, kill your monster, and then I'll deal with spiritual barrier next turn. Because I would like to kill the monster. Because if I kill... If I just scrap dragon your monster... Oh, if I just scrap dragon your monster, then these will still be there. Which means that I have to deal with them later in the duel. So, let me go ahead and just get rid of them now. I can kill the monster by just running over. So, yep, yeah, we'll just go ahead and go into the powerful Scrap Dragon. And we'll go Tinker Effect. So, he's pretty much just trying to lock me right now. Oh, yes, I would totally take a Supervise. It's called Supervise. Ain't called Supervise, you build. But nothing. Perfect. Go ahead and get through. Oh, damn, this man. This man. He's just like, quit. Like, oh, you broke my lock. You broke it. Uh oh, you, oh, you broke it. You broke it. Like, okay. Scoop it up then, I guess. And I opened up with that beautiful hand. You couldn't have stayed. I was going to get supervised. Man, you were going to lose. Oh, my God. It's going to be so beautiful. But now nah. you're like, oh, I got to quit. Like, oh, okay. Hmm. Sounds not terrible. I'd rather just summon a monk. Because why play the Rota and search for a warrior when I can just summon the warrior from my deck, right? I wonder what's going to happen to summon a monk. You yeah. know? So people say it could go up to three here in the TCG, but in the OCG it actually went down to one. You know, so I am not sure. And Summoner Monk has the power. He definitely does. There is no, there is nothing to scoff at. He to summon a level four from your deck, like that. That's 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 power. That that is power. Any revival card. Any revival card. I don't care. Any revival card. I will take. I'll go ahead and play Rota just to deck then. Nope, see, I wasn't going to get a revival card, so good thing I shuffle, shuffle one more time, and hopefully I'll get a revival card. Just give, give me, like, Silent Doom, Swing of Memories, whatever. Shit, I'll even take Call of the Haunted or Oasis. I'll take one reverse, because next time I'm summoning Armageddon and I, I don't care, I just need a revival. I need I need to live. Am I going against Cleese? Please don't tell me I'm going against Cleese, because I don't want to do against Cleese, of course. Of course, I don't want to do against Cleese. No one wants to do against Cleese. Cleese are annoying. I play Cleese on Daily Duels and they're annoying, I know. Like, how about I duel against something in my remote tier list of like tier like fucking 65? 
I want to duel against like a tier 1.5 deck. But Arcles, aren't they like 1.5? I think they're like 1.5. 1.5 or 2. They're much better than me. And you opened up with the fucking Summoner's Art for a Scout? Like I'm saying, you hit Scout to 1, like, slower the deck's consistency. Ew, now I get a shitty hand. I get two good hands, and then a shitty hand. Awesome. Oh, all I need is Armageddon Knight, Dark Greffer, Foolish. Uh, uh, ten cards. Ten cards. Three Armageddon Knights, three Dark Greffers, three Rotas, a Foolish. I have ten cards in my deck right now that I just take it and fucking be happy. Because I have two Limit Reverses. That's two. That's Yubel sending to the graveyard. I got Terra right here. It, so it would be bad because I'm going to nag myself. And some, I'm not technically nagging, but I'm not, you know, summoning from the deck. I'm just... Hand to field. So, hopefully I go ahead and draw into one of them ten cards. Ten! Ten, nigga, ten! Sh Summoner Monk. Two more. Because I will gladly pitch the fucking uh, uh, Silent Doom. So, twelve cards. Twelve! Twelve, nigga. Twelve. I'll take that eighteen. Well, come on. 12 cards in my deck right now. I could totally just draw and be happy with. But knowing my luck, I'm going to draw you though. Know. I was thinking, I was like, maybe MST. I could possibly see MST doing absolutely nothing for me right now. Oh, uh, please. 12. 12. I will gladly pitch the Silent Doom for Summoner Monk. Please. Please, don't make me fucking lose just because fucking DN wants to be like, nah, nah, now you don't get a good hand. Like, okay, thank you. Thank you. I'd rather have I'd rather have luck than skill any day. But when you play a card game, it's all about the luck. That's sad. All I fucking need all I fucking need is one of my twelve cards. If I don't get one if I, if I don't get it in this next round, I'm gonna lose. I'm totally gonna lose because I'm gonna take thirty two right now. I'll be at three thousand, yep, yep, yep. So I pretty much have to draw into one of them cards. And if I don't, I fucking lose. That's that's awesome. Oh, that's awesome. One of the 12 cards. Come on. Thank you. Fucking thank you. I'm actually happy about that. Now I just gotta be fucking extremely fucking careful. Because I can still possibly lose. Because I'm gonna course send you Bell because I got the limit reverses. But now I also gotta be, be careful of Castell and shit. Go ahead and crash. God. Like, how much damage did I fucking take? So now the question is, is he going to use his normal summon for his effect? Or is he going to summon a gadget? Alright, he's going to summon a gadget. So once again, I have to be careful. Like Yush. Wonder who's gonna attack first, depending on who attacks first. I'll do a particular play. She's building up resources. Because of course I gotta be careful. This is main phase two. Let me just go ahead and execute a cast up with the Ebel back in my deck, and then I'm gonna be super fucked. So it all depends on what does what. Oh, okay. I'm trying. So go ahead and summon Ebel. Thanks for killing my Bell, and I will get Terra. So now, pretty much, you have to cast Stell me. Which will suck, but it's not terrible. And now you have to cast Stell me. Now the question is, how many cast are you running? I mean, you clearly are running a gadget-based deck, so I'm assuming you got a lot of rank 4s in your toolbox. You only have 4 in your extra deck. I just noticed that. Nigga. Well, I hope cast is one of them. I hope Castell is one of them. The plan was to go ahead and block with Armageddon Knight and the Call of the Haunted, and then he would end his turn, and then during end phase, go ahead and play Limit Reverse. But now he wants to go ahead and just blind space one of my Limit Reverse, I'll summon Terror, which, okay, it's just gonna quit. Awesome. You were winning, and then you want to quit. Alright, it's not terrible. So, I'm assuming that he doesn't have Castell in the sector deck. One of these four cards isn't. Fucking powerful ass Castell. This Dell will be able to handle the situation just fine. Alright, one more duel. Hopefully I get a decent hand, because 
I can't have duels like that. Uh, seriously. I want to make the deck more consistent, but there's not much that can help me, really. Uh, you know what would help me? When Noden comes out. Maybe I should just start playing the deck as if Noden is out. Because as soon as Noden comes out, this deck will be Mwah! much better. Much better. More Revival Chain, easy as... Uh, see, I'm going to get a knight. It, it would literally be another Revival card. It would. Because I can go... I can go Noden, Noden Summon 4, which of course I haven't used my normal summon. XC into the Agus Arnold, Emerald Detach, Summon Normal Monster, Summon Doom Shaman. I haven't used my normal summon. Use my normal summon 4 effects, Summon Tinker, Bam, Sync 8. So it will literally be just like a swing of memories or a sound of doom, except with the accessibility of another monster and more access to my plays. Yeah, this hand's not that good, once again. My opponent has a 60 card deck with no extra deck. Awesome. So. Depending on what he does, I might just chill with Tinker. Wow, okay, I want to Dragoons. Oh, no, hand is not looking that good for me right now. Well, Tinker, of course, is allowing me to see the top card of my deck, so. Okay, I guess. Set. See, top card. Do I want a summoner monk? Well, I don't have any spells, so no. <laughs> if I had a sp if I had a one spell, I set the MST. I think that's the reason why I don't set MST generally. Now I get a spell. Ah! <laughs> stop! Fucking stop! Stop! Fucking that! Stop! Stop, Dian. You're you're driving me crazy. I go, no, I don't have any spells. Get a spell like, oh, oh, okay, thanks. Thanks, thanks. Probably gonna go ahead and activate Oasis, I'm not sure. I could take some 18s. I'll be okay for right now. I said, all I need is Armageddon Knight. That's that. All I need is something to send Doom Shaman. And we're fucking good. Like, I was just... <sighs> and Neptibus. Okay. So it's Atlanteans, but with no extra deck. So I'm assuming he's going to go ahead and send a Marksman. Because Marksman is the one that sends the set cards. <gasps> I don't know who that is. Add. You need to add. Add. So like send an Atlantean, and then you don't add. Like, you need to do that. It's mandatory. You need to finish resolving your effect. You send one Atlantean monster from your deck. Then which? Then what are you sending? Then what are you sending? Then what are you sending from deck? You already normal summoned! Nigga, the whole effect. The whole effect. The whole effect. Resolve the whole effect. Holy shit. That's a difficult. Is that Atlantean monster? No. It's not, it's not an Atlantean. It's not an Atlantean. Does that look like an Atlantean? Abyssal King Shark. It's not an Atlantean. I spelled Atlantantian. Send an Atlantean. Holy shit. I'm gonna play the fucking card and do it right. You're so lucky I don't fucking have anything right now. That's fine. That's fine. You can have that. I'm in mad. I'll take the fucking. Take the 18. I'll take the 800. Fine. Please. <sighs> it's getting stupid. It's at, at this point, it's actually getting stupid. It's actually getting comical. It's actually pretty sad. I need to kill the Lantian Prince because he can keep using his effect, so he needs to die. I even fucking use Tinker, but this is this is getting comical. 
I get an Armageddon Knight and you're fucked. Special summon the monster destroyed. Sense of grave by the flick. Them. Okay. This is actually sad. Like, please. No, I wish I had the summoner monk back. Now I'm drawing a whole bunch of spells. Like, oh, Deanna, I hate you so much. Why? Why do you insist on trolling the living shit out of me? Oh, they're all sea serpents. You wanna use your effect? Sure. Okay. And I lose 300 attack. And then you can trip you. When you do it. Okay, so you don't have your effect. Which is fine. I might be using multiple arrival cards right now, depending on what my top card is. Oh, yeah, I take 1100. That's the minus 300. Effect. Let me see the top card, please. Armageddon Knight. Rhoda. Rhoda searches me, Armageddon Knight. I will take that. I'll take that too. I will be okay. I'm literally going to come back into this duel. I'm literally going to turn this duel around. Go ahead and get rid of that card. Because I'm getting Rhoda next turn. Fucking what is that magic jammer? Oh, alright. Whew. Yes, 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 yes. Finally. This deck is driving me crazy. Like, what's up with this deck today? We're in it. We're in it. We're in it to win it, peoples. Let's go ahead and send that Doom Shaman. Summon up a storm. Doom Shaman. Supervise. Fact. Tinker. Synchro Shulkan. Bills. Supervise. Effect. Chain Tinker. Oh, this is gone. Do I want a Dark Greffer? No. I'm going balls to the wall, guys. Fact. We got two super vices and got nothing else. Like I said, all we needed was that Doom Shaman in the grave, and we could go fucking kosher. Kosher. Vice. Fat. Dang. I don't even say that. I'm not even typing right. I'm just happy that you finally ended this duel. No. Now I don't need you. I don't have any more spells in my hand. Shit. Actually, you know what? I want to get rid of this, actually. You don't have an extra deck. I don't have to worry about that. Hmm. Oh, the reason why I killed the Armageddon Knight instead of killing anything because I don't want my life points are low. So, he's gonna at least have to get, like, what, 3,400 to run over this Doom Shaman? Mm -hmm. Alright. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Alright, go ahead. Sorry, I got a text message. Yeah? My freaking yeah? My text message ringtone is my intro. Shut up! I'm judging me. Actually, it's kind of interesting because at times I'll have like some people watching my YouTube videos on their phone, and then I'll hear the intro, and I think it's my my phone going off. It's kind of funny. <laughs> I was thinking about getting rid of that water hazard. And tell you the truth, I should have, but I already selected my target because I could have just ran over that monster. I said, "Scrap dragons usually not for monsters." 
So once we turn, you can stretch them in from your hand. It's fine. Oh, you gonna use your effect of Abyss Soldier? Oh, he could actually tear me up right now. Oh wait, he, he didn't add the marksman, did he? Hmm. If he had the marksman, he could have tore me up. No, the infantry. Could he use could he use this back pitch, bounce my veals, and then infantry pot my scrap, and I've been like, no. <laughs> You know, I could have, I could have seriously, I could have got, I could have had my life endangered. I said, oh, Lordy, there's a fire. <laughs> so I ran, used my normal summon for that. And some tinker, this should be it. I'm going to go ahead and set this because I don't need it and I don't want him to say anything. Get that card. In case it's like a penguin soldier or something stupid like that. <laughs> yeah, that that's only during your turn. Destroy that. It's nothing. Then Doom Shaman kill that. Only during your turn. Not that it would change anything. It would absolutely not. But yeah, you can only do that during your turn. That's why it says once per turn. It doesn't say once per turn to either player's turn. That seems like it would be powerful. It's once per turn during either player's turn. That would definitely be main deck in Mermels. Holy shit. It's during your opponent's turn. I summon something like, nope, bounce. It would be like its own fucking pleadies. Like, whoo! Definitely. Fucking three of them, Mermels. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call that an episode. So finally, like I said... It, they want me to work. They want me to fucking work my ass off to fucking get a decent hand. Like, holy shit. Like I said, I... Noden. Noden would help. <laughs> Noden would help. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call an episode. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with Labrador Ubel. Alright, people. Thanks for watching.